I was quite so much funner. Last time I was five years old, and then I just drew a drawing. You know, I drew the rainbow and the flowers in the sun too. And then we and the other team, the rainbow one, we took the alphabet drawing. So now I'm going to start a new drawing. This time I'm my own six years old, so I know what I have to do. Let me check my colleagues what I use.
just trot through the north is very inactive. Anywhere north of it though, we'll see very warm conditions. Anywhere south of it, it is getting cooler. It will remain dry and mostly sunny in Perth. Remember you can keep up to date at news.abc.net.au and on iView. That's ABC News for now. Coming up on the ABC News channel, details of patients... Oh, I'm back. That is quick. Inquiry in Melbourne. Stay with us. I... I... C and Q. And there's Zam. Um, I think there's a game and there's think number
An epidemiologist has told the hotel quarantine inquiry more than 90% of current cases can be traced back to one family staying at a Bridges Hotel in May. The rest of the cases are likely linked to Melbourne's... It doesn't matter it takes you a while because you can finish it every time. Even if it looks ugly, you have to fix that. We don't want the silly work. The woman that will be upset because you know this and you act like Oh, you have to be very careful. Well, day, you really know the teacher don't Colorado, like it. And community transmission was all but stamped out. When the family okay, I'm positive, just gonna pull it. Was moved to hotel, and ten days later, three hotel workers tested positive. Everything is. I'm just coloring. My mission no more. The began with three travellers who stayed at another quarantine hotel in June, the Stanford Plaza. But exactly how the virus spread into the community is a mystery. We have to be very careful. And epidemiologists can't pinpoint this. And then I'm just going to use this pencil to couple up the gap. Left. You can couple up the gap. Oh no. I have my pencil. I have some sharpeners. I have this and this. Oops. I have these sharpeners. This is my other one. There you go. So I think this one. Was the offer that was made to Victoria any different to the offers nope, made to Queensland or New South Wales? Nope, Maybe, um, the offers to the states and territories were the same. Victoria recorded 222 infections today, the lowest daily Victoria case in March. In Victoria recorded 222 infections today, the lowest daily case in March. In a month, oh, the 70 percent drop in the number of people getting tested in the past week has authorities pleading for more people to get swamped. It seems uh, logical that there would be less testing, but not this much less. The big problem the okay, that it's starting to be sharpie. And then now I can use it. Every class are light or dark, so you can mix them up if you like. But I'm actually going to use light green and dark green. If you have a dark green and a light green, you can use them. So I'm just going to use. Um, my and then I'm just gonna just keep on coloring the gaps that I missed. You have to keep on coloring these gaps nice. Keep on coloring. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. There's something you have to color in that what you have to do. Color every gap what you have to do. The level of community courage and the likelihood that we will get as many as a testing positive in rapid succession. As the virus spread through Epping Gardens, management scrambles to find workers. Michael Murray has been part of the emergency aged care response and says there hasn't been enough trained staff to keep the sector running during the outbreaks. We've done this for 30 years. We knew exactly what's going on. Um, we need to get more staff. Um, and we need to get more staff straight away. There have been so much work for us, and we continue to build wrong. that all the time, and we continue Is to do that. Wrong? Four Corners has exposed how testing no, delays, a critical staff shortage, and hospital turnbacks in July hasten the spread. It's just that though. I was saying, say to this day, that we were made to believe on that. President Carmela and Yellow died last month. Her family is now leading a legal fight to get compensation from Epic Oh, Gardens. he almost died. And how are they caring, not only for my mum, but for other people? He like almost died. Uh, this is not a nice But you yeah, don't but have to worry if you don't, don't have time. Do you might do it for one season, week. Or well, you can do it in the first day. It, it depends. You don't have to cry if you're not finished. Why? You might get confused if you're crying. The teachers will be 
I'm afraid of you if you're crying and you're not finished because this video will help you about coloring. So I'm just in a hurry because this video will turn off. Okay, and I think I'm almost done. Ooh! Now, an I should be. Oops, is not there. The and then you and have to unfold it if it's cold. So this is my drawing. What you guys think? But I had to color in first. So snakes is always green. Orange. I'm just gonna call it a snake. For those who test positive for coronavirus. Now, that security guard then went on to work at Paramount and, some... and Flemington Markets while the Why does a... no Where's your lid? Where's your lid? I'm sick of people. The gardens being interviewed, and there's been no indications of breaches. Obviously, um, it's, it's inappropriate to speculate. We are reviewing CCTV footage. Oh, what is that we are reviewing oh, that's a blanket. all of the, mm. um, both the, the cases, so. the infectious um, people. And then now... Add on a more positive note, the case numbers in New South Wales continue to trend lower. Yes, there have just been three new cases recorded in New South Wales. One is in a return traveller, another is connected to the South Western Sydney funeral cluster, while the third is from an unknown source. And that's what has authorities concerned. In fact, it's been revealed today that over the past four weeks, there have been 16 cases where the source can't be traced. Now, over that time, the government and some organisations... The government? What is... No, it's just the news. Uh, an email went out to private school students there in New South Wales saying GPS sport will be suspended until further notice. And Karina, that comes into effect immediately. Oops, WA Police have charged two women who left hotel quarantine in Perth after flying in from Adelaide last night. It's alleged the women, a 19 year old from Brisbane and a 22 year old from South Australia, flew into WA with a man that did not have permission to enter the state. Police say the trio was it will be in different. a hotel while a return flight was being arranged. It's alleged the women left the hotel. You have to keep on watching me if you want to draw this. You are my story, but you have to cover every gap. Well, it would be funny. You don't want to hang it if it's funny. The teacher will laugh at you if it's so funny. Like, you don't never do that. We don't want you to do that. Queensland's tough border stance is causing heartache for many, both economically and emotionally. But it's the families unable to say goodbye to dying Ouch. relatives who are suffering the most. Now the okay, cancer I'm patient fine. Terry Moss has just weeks That's to live. Yeah. Three sons who yeah, live in southern hospitals are unable to travel to him. Terry Moss is in constant pain with bone marrow cancer. But he is determined to be by his daughter's side when she gets married in his backyard this Saturday. I wish I'd ever had it my dad could have been my mom Stacey Moss me. says the wedding has been brought forward because of her dad's terminal condition. But three of his sons who live in COVID hotspots in New South Wales and Victoria won't be there. You don't put this in your mouth because that's not safe. Only if you do it, you can just put it in your mouth. Blunt. But don't eat it. Which one I want? Is um, orange ready? Orange. There's even a cry on your orange. I need to color number two. Orange. The latest is now over with three this testing negative. We're still waiting on the fourth you result. Kind of see it, that's okay. that fourth case has had a new season. A Christmas miracle for the borders to reopen in time for the festive season. 
No. What's going on?